Hello YouTube, this is the Mind Catcher and I'm coming at you today with another Autumn Nights look. Um, <clears throat> basically it's gold and dark silvers. It's very wearable for the evening. Okay, so we're going to start off with, um, excuse me I have a cold so just bear with me. <clears throat> we're going to start off with a black um, pencil liner. I've already primed my eye and I have uh, Cover Girl Smoky Shadow Blast. So now I'm going to go ahead and start with a black liner. Well, eye pencil. Black eye pencil. And I'm going to start right here. I'm not going to take it all the way across. Just right here. And bring it in here. Doesn't have to be perfect because we're going to go over that. Now, I'm going to take a little brush here, a little eye shadow brush. I'm going to go into my Naked palette to Dark Horse. Okay. I'm just going to trace in that black line. Now I'm going to go into the color Sidecar. I'm going to take Sidecar right on my bottom lid here. Right along here from corner to corner. And you're packing it on. Now I'm going to take a flat my a flat brush here. I'm going to go into my Urban Decay pigment baked. Okay. I'm going to get some of that out of there. I'm going to pack it on right here in between sidecar and dark horse. Now I'm going to take a bigger brush and go back into Dark Horse just a little bit and try to blend things out. Now I'm going to take that smaller brush I had earlier. I'm going to go into Sin. Right there. I'm going to take it into my highlight, brown bow. And we're basically using Sin to buff out the harsh edges of the dark horse at the top. Okay, now I'm going to go back into my waterline with the CoverGirl Color Stay. And we're applying that so that we could put some more baked. Pick up a little bit. Try not to get it too much in my eye. And... Just press it in there. There's going to be fallout. And we're going to try our best to clean that up at the end. Okay, next, um, I went to Kmart the other day. I picked up a gel liner from e.l.f. And the color is Midnight, so it's a very, very, very dark blue. And it came with a nifty little brush. 
and I'm gonna dig into that and just go under where I put the bait now my skin tone it doesn't show up as blue as it does in a bottle but that's okay just looking for something to clean up that bait I'm going to go into our mascara. I'm going to use mine by e.l.f. I'm going to go over the lower lashes and the upper lashes. Okay, now that we've done that, I'm going to go ahead and apply my butterfly lash number 82 I'm gonna do and let's put the lash on and put on the eyeliner and I'm gonna put the eyeliner on exactly where the lash starts and ends I'm not gonna take the eyeliner way down here in the corner just here to here okay so I'm gonna do that and I'll be here right I am back. with the completed look I went on ahead and I did the lashes and the eyeliner like I said uh, for my lips, I use my Revlon Pearl. It's a uh, gold color. I line my lips with brown. And then I use the Revlon Pearl around the brown liner. Then I went inside the lip with the Caramel Glaze from Revlon. Okay, and excuse me, I have a cold. So if I sound a little nasally, um, I use my Black Radiance Lip Gloss, and it's a gold color. Um, put on some gold earrings, and that's it. That's about it. So I really hope you enjoy the look. Um, these, well, this eyeshadow look could be worn out for a wonderful autumn evening, a night out with someone you love. And I enjoyed doing the look. Oh, also, I went into my Coastal Sense Blush and Eye Palo Shadow Palette. Ugh, can't speak today. And I mixed, let me see, two colors. These two colors here for my cheeks. And that is it. Okay, so thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you for watching me today. Thank you, Miss Nadia. They know you're there. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Try it out for yourself. It's a very, very cute look. Um, everybody seems to like it on my end, so try it out for yourself. Okay, cyber kisses. Mm -hmm. And I'll see you guys next time. And also, keep watching for the pictures at the end, okay? Because I know my lighting may not be the best. So I'm going to add some pictures at the end of the video, okay? Take care. Bye.